biggest issue on our globe, the problem all world leaders try to solve. Poverty is something that can be found in many global films, a theme all can relate to in some way. These are some examples. In this scene from Schindler's List, the Nazis are currently sending off the Jews to the concentration camp. As the Jews were being moved, all their personal belongings were gathered and trashed. The Jews had no idea what was going to happen to them at the concentration camp. This scene shows how the Jews, who used to have professions, are now reduced to working in the fields. In this scene from the diaries of Anne Frank, the Jews are being gathered by the Nazis. The next two pictures show the contrast with Anne Frank before and after she was moved to the concentration camp. Hotel Rwanda shows the Hutus killing the Tutsis because they believe the Tutsis are inferior. This forces the Tutsis to take refuge in the hotel. Even if some of them are rich, they are forced to give up everything to save their lives. In this scene, the Tutsis are being rescued by the United Nations soldiers. Although they are being rescued, they have lost everything that belongs to them. This is a scene from Glory, which is about the Civil War. The black Union soldiers were not treated equally compared to the white soldiers. The black soldiers did not receive proper clothing and had money deducted from their wages. The white soldiers were paid $13 a month with an additional $3 clothing allotment, and black soldiers were paid $10 a month, but their $3 clothing allotment was deducted from their base salary. Even though the Civil War has ended slavery, Racism is still present in our society. In this scene from Crash, Anthony, an inner city car thief from Los Angeles, expresses why society is unjustly biased against black people, and this is why he is forced to steal cars and sell them at chop shops to make money. In this next scene, Farhad, a Persian store owner who is concerned for his safety, is trying to purchase a gun for a, from a gun store. The gun store owner refuses to sell Farhad a gun because he overhears Farhad talking to his daughter in Persian and thinks that he might be a terrorist. In this scene from Fanaja, Fanaja is walking in front of the altar and she gets yelled at by the old lady. Fanaja is of a lower caste and is therefore not allowed to stand in front of the god she is praying. This scene shows Vinaja helping her drunken father. He is drinking Tavi, which is a strong drink made for the lower caste people. The drink is cheap because it is very low in quality. Not only are the lower caste people prohibited from praying properly, but they are also prohibited from being able to purchase certain items, such as higher quality alcohol. The following scenes from Slumdog Millionaire show how people who live in the slums of India do not have many of the benefits that the majority of the world is able to enjoy. This scene shows the restrooms that the people living in the slums have to use. This scene shows the houses in the slums, which are built beside landfills and sewage pipes. This shows a makeshift tent built by orphan kids that live on land. Mohan is on the train watching the little boy sell water. The boy is selling water for 25 paise, which is less than one cent. This scene shows a farmer asking if his kids would be able to attend school, even though the other kids at the school are of a higher caste. This, this scene shows Haridas, who used to be a weaver and lost his job because machines replaced his profession. Haridas is not able to find another job because people won't give him business, because they believe he is from a weaver family and has to remain that way. In 
in this scene, there is not any racism nor casteism to force these children into poverty. The kids are simply poor orphans that try to live in a society that disregards them. They won't even give Oliver more food.